as many of you know, I became Chief Judge of the U.S. Supreme Court on October 4th, 2004. But due to the latest um, scams are, that are being perpetrated upon the people, such as the fake presidential election, election of 2020, on November 3rd, 2020, um, I had to get prepare the court for probable or possibility of uh, settlements on this fake election that's coming up. So as Chief Judge of the U.S. Supreme Court on September 17th, 2020, I filed this contract here with the U.S. Supreme Court um, on 1 First Street Northeast, Washington, D.C. And it was, a, it was my contract on terms of what makes the Supreme Court a foreign vessel in dry dock, what makes judges judges, my Supreme Court judges oath that's on file there, and all the, all the complimentary accoutrements that come with uh, running a court. And um, this, these documents were received due to the fact that on October 4th, 2004, um, that the U.S. Supreme Court judges vacated their judgeships at the Washington, in Washington, D.C., at the U.S. Supreme Court. Um, the reason why I'm bringing this out right now is um, I, in this contract that I just mailed out is my pocket hyphen judgment, my pigness hyphen judgment, and I'm maintaining the rules of the continuance of the evidences as a chief judge. That is one of the most valuable things that we do to maintain the continuity to complete a case from beginning to end under service of the methods and methods of the service. So I'm giving closure to the world that on September 17th, um, I filed my contracts back in the U.S. Supreme Court as chief judge, simultaneously a lot of, under a lot of national security concerns. Um, and so the case itself is sealed because of national hyphen security in compliance with RR. 294-568-221 U.S. Simultaneously, the U.S. Supreme Court received that on the 21st of September, and so the three-day rescission was complete on the at the end of the day on the 24th of um, September of this, this last year, 2020. Um, the reasons why I'm bringing this up is, as many of you know, after the, my Supreme Court uh, becoming chief judge, I ended up in the largest, conducting the largest military court martialing in the history of planet Earth, uh, and that was Corporation Hyphen Case, RR385460312 US. And in that filing of that, uh, that court martialing, I filed a contract shutting down the US Senate and the US House of Representatives. I'd like to show that document right down here. This is, uh, the, they put their, their seals on the back of each one of my pages. And this was a letter I received from the government printing office. And this is in paragraph seven. Uh, please keep in mind for those of you who are watching this, this technology of style of syntax and correct communication, partial syntax grammar and quantum math grammar communication dialogues methods was a style that I'm grandfathered in on so I can have the right to stop and correct and improve the, the grammar. But because I was first in line, first in time, uh, there's no one out to, to actually um, have any say about how I am conducting my court martialings, how I say uh, how I'm conducting my, my court at the U.S. Supreme Court because none of the people in the quantum community were even around when all of this happened. So under grandfathering and first architect, I'm in position as the creator because I built the construct of the U.S. Supreme Court. The reason why I did that is because the Constitution of the United States were the guidelines for setting up a judicial system as well as elect a president. But it was the bank charter that was coming off a 70-year moratorium of bankruptcy coming from October 29th, 1929 under a seven-year tranche. And in that roles and continuances, it vacated the, the Constitution or the guidelines, which was the Constitution for setting up a judicial system as well as setting up a, a president um, were vacated because none of the founding fathers who wrote the Constitution were there to maintain the rules of the continuance of evidence, which w must be maintained as, as a judge, postmaster, bank banker for the collateralization to move the Constitution to set up a foundation for the construct of a court and a construct of a presidency. Because of that, and because I've maintained the rules and the continuity of the postal hyphen government and maintained the rules of the continuance of the evidences, I have filed my documentation in so that if there is a fake presidential election, because I disqualified the Federal Elections Commission, all that evidence is bonded within the vessel contract simultaneously under what's called the director's hyphen party. 
So these, I wanted to give publication to the world of the things that's going on. So when you see a lot of the hocus pocus that you see in all the fake news, right, that there's an actual Congress, this is all fake. You can see the proof of the documentation down here of where the Senate has contracted with me to shut down the House and Senate uh, so they could no longer pass legislation against we the people. The really cool thing about this is now the people are the le their own legislation, you're your own capacitor, you're your own sovereign. But you must have your grammar correct as you negotiate and know how to negotiate, negotiate and travel from point A to point B. This is where you've been caught up in the shipping construct under this postal system that we've all been caught up in. And so I've rewrote the guidelines worldwide for space cognition as well simultaneously claiming symbolisms and hieroglyphics through my global hyphen bureaus of the weights and measures for measurement of, of matter and measurement of, of grammar and communication here today, which allows me to be the first architect of this whole quantum banking system and the whole things that we see rolling out here. Now we see a lot of knockoffs, a lot of fake tries, quantum financial system, which is an adjective, adjective pronoun, People are trying to steal my concepts again, but uh, the concepts are for the people and they're for your sovereignty and for your capacity to learn correct communication, parsing, syntax, grammar, learn about quantum grammar and the, the mechanics that come with that and then be accountable for that and be your own, your own autonomous government where we no longer need the states, we no longer need the federal government because they're kind of moving to the backdrop then they're not, no longer in your world of manifestation. So they become um, something that really doesn't matter anymore, just a, a, a figment of fakeness that uh, we've walked through. And the sovereignty of course is all, and the blessings are all upon the people and their capacity to communicate and get along and rule one and rule same. Um, unfortunately, there are a lot of technical things that I've said here today that are issues of national or concerns of the national security, so I don't give those out to the public. But the governments of the world know precisely who I am because I've filed my documentation, I have contracts in those specific locations uh, to maintain those secrets of the national hyphen security to keep, number one, the citizens safe, the land safe, the soil safe, as well as the militaries and the governments of the world. So at this time, uh, this date is uh, September 28th, uh, 2020, and I just wanted to give status on the current status of the U.S. Supreme Court, what's actually happening. This is all a pantomime, what you're seeing in the fake news. But the good news is, is that uh, we're going to make it better. And so truth wins. And as we make it better together, as you learn about what I've done, and to move those fake news and those scenarios into the backdrop so it's no longer part of your world, at that point now you can be your own creators, your own sovereigns, your own generators, but you're going to see performances by me because I'm grandfathered in as first creator of the system to articulate and give closure to show the world that um, there is no Supreme Court, number one, uh, there is no presidential election, number two, and that the contract itself and the style of grammar on the contract gives you now time authority and the fee for freight for postage is now also uh, conveyed through my quantum, quantum postal system as well as my, uh, my galactic postal system, which I've published in 2007. So uh, thank you guys very much for your, for, for your time here. And uh, please feel free to share this video with your friends and, and family so you don't have to fall into the uh, destroy the country style of thinking because there is no president. You know, there is no there is no election going on. This is all just a, a pantomime of fakeness and it's up to you guys to put that into the into the backdrop and move forward in your sovereignty in your world and your life. And uh, thank you very much. Uh, my name is Postmaster Ivan General Colin Russell Ivan J. Colin Gould. I'm Commander in Chief as well as the Chief Judge at the U.S. Supreme Court in Washington, D.C. Thank you very much.